welcome to my first ever haul. So today I am going to be showing you some of the stuff I recently bought. Now this is just cookware stuff for baking as you've probably seen from my channel cooking with Colette. So I bought loads of baking stuff for Colette. I bought some cutters, um, simple cookie sort of jigsaw shape which is pretty cool I also got this is one of those and a little one of those too to go cute I've got a little baby foot one which I thought was really good um, just so you know these all come from the website something sweet um, which is um, a magazine which I will leave the link down below for the website and also my video which I also talk about what it is and what I bought and these little so cute I bought some boxes to put some stuff in so this is a box which is really nice and decorated and I bought it from Ocon with this this is a silicone wand so you can make chocolate parcels so it actually does match the box as you can see so you can just put it back in the box so these are most of them they are reusable boxes which are good and they also come with little separators so if you want to separate in the box you can use those I also bought another box this is a truffle box just plain circle but I think that's a pretty cool thing so I like that and this is a little heart shaped cookie cut for some bags to decorate and it also comes with ribbon as well so you can tie them up I bought is an egg separator so you cut the egg the yolk um, stays on there and then the egg like goes through. I think that's pretty cool. For normal cupcake cases, you've got small or you've got big. And also, I got these little ones as well, which I've got, which are really cool. So I really like them. Oh, and I hope you like my new background. Um, I love One Direction, obviously. Um, this is a modelling tool, so if you're using fondant or icing, you can just use it to make whatever model you want. I bought this is a chick cut, as you can see, there's a chick there and an egg there, which is really good for Easter and also to match up my normal egg. one is also my favourite. This is um, for it to take it out. Ooh, that's the packet. This is a, um, a mice set so you can make chocolate mice and they're Asian Cora things. Where is it gone? Um, aha. There's these little, little tails to come with them which are cool. Um, we got an embroider. Um, which is really cool so you just put it on top of your cake you put icing over the top of it and then it makes the pattern of this and you just take this off how cool chocolate cup mold so you paint the mold and then you fill it with chocolate afterwards so you've got like a little cup thing instead of that with chocolate this one I haven't put together yet but this is actually a little bag a flat pack bag Ta -da! How cool is that? So you can put your chocolates or truffles in there too. Um, I bought this little book to make baked cupcakes decorating. It is really cool and it's got tips and recipes and shows you how to make different icing and other 
things is so brilliant and the lavishment shows you how to make your own piping bags and that's brilliant now i like this one too this is actually a jelly baby mold so you just fill it with the glue tin and everything put them in the fridge to set and then hey so you have jelly babies now if you don't like jelly babies and you like chocolate buttons then this is what this is this is a chocolate button mold now if you think it's dirty it's because you'd have to wash them before using them because they're dirty from where they've been packed um, you get cake ribbons so you put this over a cake let's say and then it just looks really nice and fancy got some piping bags very useful and a piping top I got these two these are push cutters so you cut put the cutter in push it out and then when you want to put it down you just push down and then it pops out for you how cool is that so you've got this one this one and the really small one okay i can't pull this off so i'm just going to leave that one <laughs> i've also got another selection to go with this so say this goes with this say you want one in a box of these two which are piping tops so you put the top one here and you put the other bit on there and you get a nice colour so these are really cool and I got a um, flower embroider so you put the flower ribbon in and push it down and when you take it out you have a lovely flower to put on top of your cake mini egg molds do I have to say any more? <laughs> nope. I will use this one. Um, this is a, sh a chocolate shell maker. So you just put shells, uh, shells? You put chocolate in here and you can mix whatever flavoured you want. Hello. <laughs> and then you just put it in the fridge, let it set, pop them up, put them in a bag, or wrap them up, or whatever you want to do. And then you have your seashells. They're really good for Mother's Day. This is a basket embroider. So if you want to make a basket cake, this shows you easy to swap. Just move it down the side and then you get the basket you sort of woven effect on the side of your cake. Lots and lots and lots of other recipes which I will try out on my channel and I will not bake any more of them without you. The only one I have used is this one because it's very dirty but it's a basic vanilla cupcake and they're really good for parties Ooh. another flat pack one which i haven't done yet i'm guessing it goes like that like that like that and like that like that, like that. there we go Wow. how cute is that I like that another embroider it's a daffodil another embroider one, two, three, four, five, six, six different nozzles so here's one of them, just a straightforward circle, a small circle, so if you want to do like themes and stuff. This one is called a flower, so you know on the outside of a cake they give you little blobs, that's the one to use. This one's a little swell. This one is the sideways one. And this one is another little flower one, and that's some really neat colours. Some more ribbons and some bags they are quite big this is one bag and ribbons 
They're quite big too, so there you go. Yeah, that's a gem. Use a cupcake topper, so you just put the fondant on and then you paint over the top of these and then you have like a handbag on top of your cupcake issue. Somebody holding a cupcake, a hat, some flowers, some more flowers and another lady or a boy, I'm not sure, holding a cupcake. And the last thing, which I really can't wait to use, is this. It would be really good if you, I turned you into those bars. This is a gems um, mould. So you put different coloured glitter in it. And then when you put them out after they set, you've got little like diamond gems. And they're really cool, so I like that. So you've seen all of the stuff that I've bought and um, all of the stuff I can't wait to share with you to make. So without further ado, I will leave the end of the video there because I can't wait to get cooking. Um, thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. Um, again I will leave a link down below to the actual website and a link to my video where I explain what the magazine is all about. And leave a comment down below for any more ideas um, for future videos or what you want me to cook first or what piece you want me to use first. So, um, till next time, bye!